Back at Stateville, my job was to give lethal injections to death row inmates. Wow. It's heavy. Yes. People could watch through a window, and I remember, I remember her trying to be brave for the baby as I injected the thiopental, the pavillon, potassium. Gabriel was only two. He never knew his dad. Dr. Truman, you don't really have to talk about this now no. if you don't want to. Back then, I thought it was the right thing. I thought there were criminals who deserved to die and lethal injection was the most humane way. As time went on, my thinking's changed. It's about the death penalty. Who lives and dies should be decided by God, not a jury. I've spent the last five years tracking the loved ones of the men I've killed, trying to make amends with those families. How do you make amends? Financial aid, mostly. It's all I have to offer. I paid a mortgage, bought a, bought a car, sent a child to college. Some people told me to get lost. Others took what I could offer. Well, that's really brave and generous. No. They're all acts of contrition, small things. Nothing will ever bring back a husband or son, father. Saving a kid's life isn't a small thing. I'm just trying to tell God how sorry I am for what I've done. Please. I need that boy to live. <laughs>